starting off with Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in, in Taupe with my Zoeva 317 Wing Liner Brush. I first start at the bottom of the brow and I kind of give it its starting shape. And then I start moving that product upwards. And I kind of push that product upwards with the brush horizontally. And now I'm going in and perfecting the tail. Now I go on the top of the brow and I kind of uh, draw a line so that I can get the correct shape of the brow. I'm pushing that product upwards and trying to get in between the hairs. Next with my NYX uh, Micro Brow Pencil in Taupe. I'm going to use the spoolie end to brush that product through. And then I use the pencil side and I'm drawing hairs in the front of the brow. And then filling in some spots that I thought were sparse throughout the whole thing. And then I'm taking Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. I know it, the words have rubbed off the container, but I'm just brushing that through my brows. And then with NYX HD Concealer Wand in Porcelain, I'm applying that to under my brow. Then with my Firma Beauty 203 Concealer Brush, I am perfecting the underside of the brow. Then using an e.l.f. Flawless Concealer Brush to blend out all of that product. And picking up my Firma Beauty 203 Concealer Brush again and I am fixing the underside of the brow. I felt like it was a weird shape so I'm just going in and making it the desired shape that I want. Then with my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in Fair, applying that to the top side of my brow. Then I'm cutting that out with my Sigma F75 brush. And again, blending that out with my e.l.f. Flawless Concealer brush. Then I comb through the brow again and with the pencil side I'm going in and cleaning up the top, making it the desired shape, you know with the concealer you tend to make it a weird shape so I'm just going over that and make sure it's good. And that's a finished brow. So stay tuned to see this look here. And thanks for watching.